So on a wet and rainy day, there's almost nothing better than checking out one of those areas that you're just not so sure about. Bobby and I went to Schenectady Central Park, rode it for a couple hours, squeezed out six and a half miles. Uh, there's a lot of woodwork and they did a good job. The trails were super wet. The woodwork was extremely slippery. I managed to have a pretty good time. There's a lot of climb up, roll down, climb up, roll down. The trails had a lot of sniper roots hidden underneath those leaves. The trails around the outer edge were mostly flat and the trails in the beginning and around the central part was all up and down so you climb up and roll down a little bit climb yeah. up and roll down it was pretty good i mean okay. it's not a place that i would rank real high on my list but it's certainly a place that i wouldn't shy away That's from if somebody for, wanted to go sure trails up. are typically on the easy side <laughs> Fucker. Although on trail forks they're all marked, I believe, as blue trails. Oh, okay. Maybe. There's some log overs, uh, but other than that, they're all basically all right. pretty simple. Yep. The area is pretty small, and there's a lot of trail packed into that small area. So it's pretty easy to get kind of confused as to where you're going and to be kind of lost, but really doesn't make any difference because it's a pretty small area. I think the trails, if you were to ride every single one of them once, probably equals maybe about five miles. Good stop. Okay, I climbed that little hill, now I gotta rest for an hour. Nice body. Bobby's standing in the mouth. Nice.
As soon as he's out in front, puts me right in the hurt locker. I believe this one is called Big Girl Pants. <laughs> yep. <laughs>